guys, Plant Based Gabriel here. I am back at Pawpaw Island where I recently filmed a video on how, where, and when to find pawpaws. And today I wanted to do a specific taste test. So I have here a perfectly ripe pawpaw and I wanted to go ahead, give it a try, and tell you my thoughts. Again, I just like to go in. If I have a spoon, I'll scoop it out. Or if I have a knife, I'll just pull it out. And there is seeds. Now you're one gonna you don't want to eat the seeds, but the pulp around it you can eat, and then you just spit the seed out. And that is what the seed looks like. I like to save the seeds, hopefully planting some pawpaws on the farm soon. But really, these are wild pawpaws, and for me, the best flavor. I find it tastes somewhere around a banana, pineapple, mango, and a little bit of peach. Dr. Miller thinks it tastes more peachy than I do. I find a little bit of peach flavor, uh, but absolutely fantastic my all-time favorite fruit if you can get your hands on these you should go ahead and buy up all you can because they are so good super healthy these are a super fruit a super food and they grow just in, in, in your back door if you live in the east coast we were just at an apple orchard with fences all around the orchard and what do you think was on the outside of the orchard pawpaws they were keeping the pawpaws out and growing apples I think it's time in America we start growing pawpaws. I know I'm going to. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did and you're on Facebook or YouTube, make sure you like the page, subscribe, and hit that little bell to get notified whenever I post a new video. And as always, this video, this blog, and all my other plant-based recipes can be found at plantbasedgabriel.com. I am Plant-Based Gabriel, hoping that I will see you guys very, very soon.